So hey YouTube, today I'm going to be showing you how to, to create a random terrain generator. So as you can see, this is what the terrain looks like right now. Now when I press the green flag, it's going to create something different. So I will be showing you how to create this, but I will only be showing you how to create this in stone. In stone colors. So, and you only really need to know one, um, how to make one object create a terrain to, to know how to make others create a terrain. So, you know, I'll come back when I start the new project. So I have started the new project, and what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to make everything blank, just start from scratch. And then you're going to want to go to costumes and then make it whatever color you want. So I'm just going to zoom in. So I don't know what measurement to use, but but um, one click represents one step taken by the by the sprite. So I'm just going to do it eight by eight for now, and then I'm going to know that I'm going to need to make him move eight steps up in the Y each time. But before I but before I make it. Eight. I'm just going to make it 16 because that was how big the other one it was because that was how big the example was. So I'm gonna come back when I make it 16 by 16. So it is 16 by 16, and because I said I'd be making it with a stone color, I'm going to change the color to a stone color. So if the bottom right corner of this is negative 240 and y negative 180 so I'm go I'm just going to make it so that it's 240 minus 16 and no negative 240 plus 16 is what I meant and negative 180 plus 16 again so Negative two, so I'm gonna come back when I um when I get it in the right coordinates. So when the flag is now clicked, he goes to the right position, and that would be x negative two go to x negative two hundred thirty two y negative one hundred seventy two. So now what we're going to do is um have a repeat 30 times. If you did it where it was um, 8 clicks by 8 clicks of any color, then you'd have to make it so that it would be 60 because that, because 16, no, because, because 8 is half of 16. And so, yeah. And now what we're going to want to do is repeat, pick random, whatever you want. So I'm just going to do it 10 to 12, I think it was, 10 to 12 for my um, 40 explaining part. So now we're going to want to make him, so if you're doing it with other costumes, you'd want to make him switch to a certain costume and then stamp and then change Y um, so then you're going to want to change Y by 16 because that's how many clicks you did up and to the right or just stop I guess and then after it's done with this, you're going to want to go to X position plus 16 because it's 16 by 16. But if you had it 16 by 8, it would be six. It would be go to X X position. No, go to X position plus 8. And then you just want to add 172. So I'm going to put that 100 no, at 16 because that's how big my block is. And now when I put it here, 
Oh, no. Right here. It should work. So, as you can see, it's building a random terrain. And, um, yeah, that's basically all you need. If you want to add in the sky, well, all you're going to have to do is go to backdrops. And, um, go to fill. Go to the bottom one and pick whatever color you want. And, boom. Now, when I click flag, he's go it's going to build it. Um, oh, and also, this just builds on top of the, um, this builds on top of each other, unless you put in another block called clear, and you can get that from pen. So now whenever I click flag, it's just going to go to the sky, and just, yeah, creates a random train again. So, yeah, that's all for today, YouTube, so bye.